I know you, you you say no, but just it been some time now. You know what I'm saying? Do you ever? And you said no because they went from you to celebrities. But do you ever now look back like, damn man, that that million dollars worth of game it hurt? Um, it hurt then. I ain't gonna cap. Like it, it 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 wasn't that it hurt. It was just we didn't say goodbye or wasn't fine. So it left it so open that it was like you know it was a little rough. But it's like the thing about it was was that. It was rough because of how people took it. I didn't take it rough. I knew from the beginning I was a guest host. Like when I, my first day there, it was just like a trial. You know what I mean? We shot three episodes first day. So it was like, oh, they f***ing with it. And then we kept going. I never was a co-host. A lot of people got that twisted. Like that is the this baby. Like you got to understand. Understand me as a game, you got to understand Gilly. Okay? So talking about somebody that rose and fell in the music industry more than once or in entertainment period right so you figure you got this group in philadelphia you try to make it but you get close jay-z offering them a deal it ain't right they turn it down boom it's gone state property gets the deal that major figures technically was supposed to have then they make it they go boom then you go again he with wayne and them he writing or whatever mm -hmm. he got wayne sounding like gilly the first carter every philadelphia person know that's gilly the kid back and forth just hearing them the ad-libs all that you know and that's Wobble it, wobble it, drop it like it's hot to lyrical Wayne. That's yeah. just a fact. You get that, that blow up. You tell him he wrote DJ, it, whatever. Man, then Jay, it went down. People were like you, you know, they still fuck with Wayne. Wayne ends up being this huge star. This nigga get in his bed, talk a little shit, say that's a million dollars worth of game. Right? He turns that into a million dollar fucking thing. That's a that's a big dog. So it's like when you look at it like that, why the fuck would I become the girl of that? You know what I'm saying? Why, that's what his. Do you know? Because that's it's, it wasn't for me. It was for it's it's a it's a show. It's a it's a boys club. First of all, it's not for girls. It's really not a girl thing. Um, I think it was cool to have a female on there, but I don't think a female belonged on there. You know, guys. Some guys want to watch. You know, a guy show talk about sports and shit. I don't know the difference between a touchdown and a fucking in a walk, a travel. I ain't on that. That's not my thing. You know what I mean? So it's like. If you understand that in in their platform, you will respect the fact that. Yo, the fact that I even did it, I still get paid off of that shit. I'm I'm on the game album. The game put me on this album. Something I said on that show two years ago. Like, it's not a bad thing. It's a great thing. You feel me? They my niggas. I was with them niggas a week or two ago. Like, they my niggas. I fuck with them. It was never, contrary to public opinion, it was never like no argument or fight or nothing. They just moved the fuck on. Whether you liked it or not, you niggas still watched it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Y'all watch it. Their views are great. They doing well. You so know what I'm saying? So you don't look back and be like, "What if type vibe?" Like, fuck no. I my podcast by myself is the shit. I go hard by myself for 50 minutes. Don't nobody do that shit. <laughs> like niggas can't. No shame, but niggas gotta have six hosts. Niggas can't hold that shit down. You know what I mean? Like I go 50 minutes and it's hilarious. You can watch some of the episodes and laugh the whole fucking time. I couldn't do that with them. I could barely get a word in. It's three big ass personalities trying to talk at once. Fuck no, I don't look back at that like, mm. I look back at it like, great. And when niggas call me and say, yo, you the girl from this million dollars for game? Can I pay you 5K to come see it for 20 minutes? Yes, I'll be there and that's me. Like it was good, it's a good thing. It's not a bad thing, like what? No, I don't think it's a bad thing, but I mean, we hear me like sometimes niggas feel. I never think what if. It never felt like mine. And, and honestly, like, you feel like you're in a shadow because they bigger than you. You know what I'm saying? They so big that I was the girlfriend I was with a game for like a year. It took a year for niggas to stop talking to me like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, to separate me. I came there, don't call me white girl, already buzzing. They shit so big and it locked us together. It was it, it felt good to get a part of it again because I am a one-man band. Like, this is it. It's me. Like, I'm good at this shit. I don't need no three-piece, no shade, but...